If you want to hear one of the most remarkable stories of persistence and resilience, look no further than oak trees. So here's a little oak seedling at Bear Island. It's six or eight inches tall. And while trees of other species that are this tall might just be a year or two old, its height is actually not a good indicator of how old it is. What red oak does is it creates these acorns for the lucky few oak seedlings that sprout from those acorns. They don't start growing up right away. They feed on that acorn usually for like three to five years and establish a deep and expansive root system. For a little oak seedling like this one, it could be three feet long. Oaks can wait as a seedling like this, just feeding off that expansive root system in near or complete shade for decades. And what they're waiting for is a disturbance, for something to happen for the trees that are overtopping them to die. And when that does happen, they'll have this really amazing root system that will allow them to shoot upward really, really quickly. That root system is also the reason why oak are such a fire adapted species. It's not that these oak seedlings can just survive or withstand fires. It's that when a fire comes through, it might kill everything else in the understory. And the oak with that root system and with these little buds just below the surface of the soil will shoot upwards and be able to capitalize on that. So if you see a little oak seedling in the understory of the forest, it might actually be a much older tree that's just waiting for its chance to shoot upward into the canopy.